My favorite France jersey that I own is of course the 2000 jersey and unfortunately I won't, don't wear it as often anymore and you will see soon why. This to me is the perfect French kit. Why? It has the correct blue, it has the nice red band across so it features some red, it has a little bit of French flag here on the collar. Yes, we can, this, I, we, we can discuss two things on this shirt. Three actually, that could make it even better. Uh, the collar here looks a little bit weird because it's very, very open. Uh, maybe something could have been done better, but it really nicely connects here. And this was the style in 2000. I like how the Federation crest was up and also the Adidas logo. So it creates a very balanced look on the front. And then you had the number below here. So it all made a lot of sense. I also like how Adidas managed it always to put the French flag on the home jersey. We have the three white stripes and then they add just this fabric and we have a French flag here. This was always a super classy touch. The other thing that I kind of regret is here we have the French flag, here we don't. Make Put the French flag around here and it's absolutely perfect. Absolutely perfect. Uh, we have here also the Adidas equipment logos are on the inside color. And yeah, other than that, it's very white. It has a white outline towards the bottom. And of course, this, since it's a replica, the, that it is an authentic product. This tag, I think I liked it better on the 96 jersey. And the other, the last thing that I don't like as much is how the sleeve cuffs are kind of a little bit more open towards the top. It makes sense within the jersey. I mean, the way it is made, it makes sense. It just looked a little bit odd. And of course, we have the first star. Now, I said there's a number and you could get this jersey, but I back, back in the time I had to look hard to actually get it with my favorite player Zidane. And I actually ordered it from France. And the reason why I don't wear it is because this number is damaged already. And if you wash it, there's already quite some I don't know if you see it where, especially on the zero, I have to find a way to repair this, at least get, get this colored up again and then maybe seal it somehow. If you have any tips on that, I, gotta I would be happy. You can also see that this jersey, although it's, it's a replica, it has some special venting here on the side and also where the number is over the, on the back. So this is actually closer to the player's version than one might expect. Absolutely, absolutely love this shirt. I love it also because there back then I used all my knowledge of French in the end and didn't to order this one. This came from France. You couldn't get this here uh, in Austria or even in Germany. Now it's easy. You can order from anywhere and you can get your favorite player. Back then this was really, 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 really hard to get. And I love this jersey so much I was even considering at one point framing it and hanging it in my apartment. That was of course when I was still living by myself. Yeah, absolute winner. My favorite France jersey. I wish they would do something similar. Color-wise, have a little bit red, have a little bit white on there. It's absolutely gorgeous. Absolute favorite. Well, let me know what you think about this France jersey. Um, give me a thumbs up if you liked that video, subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this, and I will talk to you soon. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and subscribe to my channel. If you've already done so, I would like to thank you for your support. It is very much appreciated. Also, check out the accompanying blog at the link provided in the description below and at the end of this video. Thank you for watching, and until next time.